I come from a migrant family. I grew up here in uh, between Windsor and Eaton. We had 12 children and I am the oldest. I didn't finish high school because back then our parents did not need to send us to school uh, full time. And so I stayed home and helped my mom raise the rest of the children. But later on in life, I uh, decided I wanted to go to college. That was my goal in life. And so I did. I went to Ames. I started cleaning apartments, cleaning houses. That's how I paid for my books and I learned that there were scholarships that I could apply for and so I applied for them. So I continued going to Ames uh, quite a few years, quite a few years. You know, I first became a CNA. Then I, again, I uh, wanted to be a teacher. So I went and got my teaching certificate at Ames Community College and at that time they had an adult program going on. So they asked me after I got my certificate if I would help teach uh, bilingual English to grown-ups and I said yes of course I will. So I was uh, raising my children, you know, um, they all wanted the best the best Nikes, the best jackets. And I said, well, you know, on my income, we really cannot afford $120 Nike tennis shoes. And so I decided, oh, hey, I have to teach my children that you don't have to keep up with the Jones to make a difference in life. I started this nonprofit's Gifts from the Heart so that I could help people. I was blessed with many people who helped me along the way. And so I wanted to give back to those that didn't have uh, what I thought, at least the basics, to, to feel warm, to feel fed, and to feel loved. And so we started in the back trunk of my car with uh, three bundles of winter clothes, because it was the middle of January. I saw people, I gave them gloves, blankets, whatever they needed. And of course, my children were a part of this. And um, from there, it just grew. People just knew that I could give them clothing, blankets, jackets, and uh, from serving probably 100 families a year, now we serve over 4,000 families a year. We do anybody and everybody, and everything we do, we give it out free. I do a little bit of everything in the community, and uh, we, I just help a person start up the homeless the Greeley Kitchen. And so uh, we also feed the homeless and I clothe the homeless and help them out with whatever they need. And uh, we minister to them a lot. Started branching out to Gilchrist. And so the social worker at Gilchrist and I work very hard, very close and very hard together. We will give families anything from clothing blankets, jackets, uh, hygiene products, diapers, anything that a family needs to get back on their feet or if they're going through some hardship times, uh, they may need a little extra help. Uh, a woman's place is someone that I work very close with. The North Range Behavior is another agency that we work very close together. And of course, the schools. We are in a lot of the schools help us out a lot. And, we take them the items to donate to the children, the families. So to me, as I tell people that donate items, you are now part of Gifts from the Heart.